course of the year we had uh, a lot of good things occur, uh, although extremely disappointed that we're not still playing today. Uh, there's a lot to look to and be encouraged by. Uh, the center of our diamond is, is really encouraging and they're, and they're returning. So I think, you know, you add JD to that center, think about the, the leadership in our clubhouse from Josh Donaldson, Tulo, Russ Martin, uh, obviously Jay Happ and Marco Estrada. Uh, really, there's a, there's a lot to build from with that. And that's not taking anything away from the contributions that Edwin and Jose and Michael Saunders and Brett Cecil have had uh, to that environment, to that culture. Uh, but, you know, having said that, you know, feel like the, the progress of our major league team, uh, the progress and additions, or excuse me, the additions that we've made to our major league talent, and then the fact that we feel better about our farm system than we did a year ago and that we've added to it, uh, puts us in a, in a position to feel confident that with a productive offseason, uh, with a productive winter, uh, that we will push the needle even closer to bringing a, bringing a championship back to Canada. It's one thing to be told that, it's another thing to feel it as you uh, walk down the street, as someone knocks on my door in my neighborhood, as someone stops me in my car. Uh, there's, a, there's a level of pride for this team that is uh, significant, it's robust, it's like nothing I've ever experienced. So, and I think it has a lot to do with the fact that we're representing a nation. Uh, that it'll never be about me, it'll never be about any one person. Uh, this is first and foremost Canada's and Toronto's team and you know, ultimately we're going to need uh, a collective effort to continue to bring a championship team to this, to this city and country.